infinite loop in Cypress test. That's not what I wanted to do. How did this happen? I wanted to explain or to show how you can do an easy drag and drop with Cypress because drag and drop in Selenium is everywhere. Drag and drop uh, in other tools is also everywhere on the internet. Plus drag and drop can in a lot of projects happen and you will need to do drag and drop automation. And if you do it with uh, Cypress, then it's a good thing to explore how to do it. So I had a look on the internet and on the official documentation. And the first thing that popped into my search was an NPM package. So I'm talking about the Cypress drag and drop package. I installed it as per the documentation and then I did okay, ci.visit. And then as documentation states, I get the first element and I drag it to the second element. But what happens there? Well, let's start the test and have a look. And as you can see, there's no drag and drop happening and the test is running in an infinite loop. So if you've never seen an infinite loop in Cypress, have a look here. But this doesn't solve my problem or my use case. I wanted to show you how you can do drag and drop. Now, I'm not saying that using the drag and drop uh, NPM package, it will not work for you. You can try this first. So you just uh, uh, Google for the drag and drop NPM package uh, for Cypress and you can try that. It may work in your circumstance, but if it doesn't, the workaround which or the, the solution which I'm going to show you is on the first glance pretty similar. I am using a drag tool, but what is this drag tool? Well, this drag tool is a custom command where you basically use the same principle. So you trigger the, or you, you start with an, an element on which you trigger the uh, trigger actually and then you drop to the element but the, the important part of what makes this um, command work don't worry i'm going to copy the code and post it as a comment so that you have also the code for, for you to use data transfer so with the data transfer this is what makes actually the whole uh, drag and drop work in my case now you don't need to believe me let's have a look to see if it actually works and as you can see this infinite loop is still there it's still um processing now let's just stop that one first and now you can see that a is in the place of b and b is in the place of a and this is how you do drag and drop in cyprus now i hope you like the video as always thank you for watching and i will see you in the next one have a good one and bye bye